Michael Strawn's daughter, Isabella, is finishing up her final round of radiation, and supporters of the former football star are sending loads of well wishes the family's way. In a new YouTube video shared on Tuesday, Jan, year 16, the 19-year-old documented another step of her health journey, noting that she has finished radiation treatment. She recently opened up about her medulloblastoma diagnosis during an appearance on Good Morning America on Jan. 11. The candid vlog found the college student recording from what looked to be inside her closet, searching for an outfit to wear for the celebratory occasion of ringing the bell to signify her radiation completion. After having a hard time deciding what she wanted to wear, she landed on a gray turtleneck sweater and jeans. She then addressed fans, detailing that she's excited to be done with the treatment, as it's something she had to go to every day. All in all, Isabella hopes to heal her head from all of this, after a long six weeks, and is looking forward to not dealing with the side effects she currently has been experiencing, such as dizziness. Thank you all for the love and support. Continuing on this journey, radiation is done. The video was captioned as she expressed her excitement at this major step toward healing. In the comments section, fans flooded in with sweet comments for the celebratory occasion. Congratulations on finishing your radiation treatments, one wrote, alongside several bell emojis. Hi, so happy for you, one step at a time. I understood how it feels to dread waking up, because I deal with a lot of pain every day from a neck injury. Anyways, I pray, you make a full recovery and live your dreams. God bless. Another penned. A third sent an encouraging word while thanking the young woman for her transparency, adding, Stay strong, beautiful girl. You are so sweet. Thank you for sharing your journey. As was previously reported, Isabella was diagnosed in late Oct, barely a month after she began to experience symptoms as she commenced her first year of college. I didn't notice anything was off till probably like Oak Tours 1, she told the broadcast's co-host, Robin Roberts. That's when I definitely noticed headaches, nausea, couldn't walk straight. After thinking at first that it may have been vertigo by Oct 25, she realized things were much worse when she woke up throwing up blood. She consulted with her family, who insisted she get a thorough checkup resulting in the discovery of a fast-growing tumor larger than a golf ball in the back of her brain.